Hey, what's up my Tacoma buddies? My name is Alex and welcome back to my channel, Tacoma Modzella. If you are new to the channel, welcome and I hope that you'll find my channel useful. It's another cold day, so I'm just going to bring to you a short and quick video and this is on how to customize your screen image so it'll give you a more personalized look and hopefully that'll give you a better driving experience. I'll show you on how to resize your images so it fills the screen fully and also how to retain that image on the screen after startup or while you are driving. So stick around. I'm going to try to make this quick and simple and I'll show you how it's done. To begin, plug in a USB stick and create two new folders in it. One will be called startup image and the other will be called display off image. Take note that uh, the S and the I are capitalized in startup image and the D, the O and the I are capitalized in display off image. So now that I have uh, selected the two photos that I wanna use for my startup display and my display off image. I would like to make sure that when the photo is displaying on the screen that it's actually displaying from edge to edge. I don't want to see any white borders on the top or the left or the right or the bottom. So in order to do that you need to edit your photos and make sure that the dimensions match the actual dimension, dimensions of your display screen. And 885 pixels by 550 pixels work out really well. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. I use Adobe Photoshop to edit my photos. So in this case, I've set it to 885 by 550. And I'm just gonna put that image in that dimension box where I want it. I'm gonna hit enter. And I'm gonna save this first file into that USB stick that uh, we first uh, loaded and created folders for. So this one's gonna reside on the startup image folder. The file name does not really matter. What matters is that we're saving this as a JPEG format, but the file extension has to be JPEG, not just JPG, which is the default, you have to rename it as JPEG. So go, go ahead and save that. Click on OK. Close that off. So now for my display off image, same thing. I would like to crop that at 885 by 550 pixels. That looks pretty good to me. Now I'm going to save it into the other folder that we created. And this one, this one will reside under display off image. And again, file name does not matter. What matters is the extension uh, .jpeg. Save it. And now we can move into our truck and load the images. You can actually save more than just one file. You can save up to three. So uh, three for the display off image and three for the startup image. So it gives you the flexibility to change your photos um, every now and then and um, just to make sure that you don't get bored staring at the same photo over and over and over. Now that I'm in my truck, I'm going to go ahead and switch it on to accessory mode. Take your USB stick, plug it into your USB port. And next is you go to your settings scroll down to customize startup image and then hit on uh, transfer it will automatically detect what's in those folders and we'll copy it over select it click on ok it'll do its update and now i'm going to do the same thing for the screen off image so click on transfer select yes will automatically find that image again accordingly. Select it, click on OK. So when you start your vehicle, you'll go through the uh, default images and there you go. Now I have my logo there. 
as my startup image and uh, if I want my custom photo to show I go to my settings and then I'll turn the screen off and it will load that so even when I'm driving that image will always be on until I select something else there you go so that is it I hope that you'll be enjoying your drive a little bit more with your personalized screens if you learned something from this video I hope that you click on the subscribe and notification bell buttons I had fun sharing this video for sure and uh, if you have any comments or questions please post them down on the comment section below and for now if you can be anything I hope you can be kind please check my other videos and see you soon